Yo, what's up guys, DTM here with another supplement review. Sorry for the horrible camera angle. Um, my car has been baking in the sun all day uh, while I was in the gym. And I my usual spot where I put my phone unfortunately gave me a warning that it's too hot. So I have to make work, make do with this, whatever. Anyways, today I have a good review for you guys on uh, NutraFit Silence, bro. Look at that sick label with the fucking astronaut, <laughs> whatever. I'm tripping, bro. Um, Anyways, yeah, sick label. I love NutraFit, one of my favorite supplement companies. Their Carnage pre-workout, absolutely slapped. Love that one. I love their aminos. Those things tasted so good, so hydrating. Um, this is the third product I've had from the company. I've never tried Symbiote, which people say is fire as well. I need to try that soon. Um, let's talk about Silence. It's a sleep aid. I'm sure you guessed that um, from the front. Honey lemon tea is the flavor. Let me start right off the bat with the flavor. I watched GGH's review and he's like, yo, this is the best tasting sleep aid. This tastes like shit, bro. I hate this, bro. I'd give this like a three out of 10 for flavor. It's drinkable, but it's not good, like at all. Like I don't like, I mean, honey lemon tea sounds like one of the worst flavors you could even come up with. So before tasting it, I was already like, this is probably gonna suck because that doesn't sound good to me. But if you're a honey lemon tea guy, maybe just right up your alley. But I'm like, nah, I'll slam it. I tried to sip it the first night and I was like, bro, I cannot. So I just slam it back and I'm good to go. But I'm willing to overlook the flavor because spoiler alert, this shit slaps. This is like the best sleep aid I've ever used. So I'll overlook it um, for the flavor, which I don't like. If they come out with this in like a blue raspberry or some shit, dude, I'd buy like 600 of these tubs, like straight up. Anyways, let's get into the label. Um, I'll try and slap the label up here so you guys can see it. You got vitamin B6 as uh, pyridoxal 5-phosphate. Um, people say that's good before bed, lowers prolactin and stuff. Magnesium, zinc, L-glycine at three grams, which is a fat dose. GABA at one gram, pretty good dose. You got magnesium again. L-theanine at 300 milligrams. That's a fat dose of L-theanine, like 200 mg and I'm like out cold. So 300 is fire. Uh, we got chamomile, probably from the tea. Uh, we got L-tryptophan, Inozin, passion flower. No idea what that is. Uh, then we have Zenha ashwagandha. I've never heard of this extract of ashwagandha or this trademark. So no idea. I usually take KSM, but this is Zenha at 120 milligrams. Um, my guess is it's going to be kind of like Shodan ashwagandha, where 120 is like equal to like 600 to KSM, something like that. Um, that's probably the dose is probably so low. Then we got 5-HTP at 100 mg, Apigenin at 50, and Kana at 25. Kana, shit alone is worth it just for the Kana. Um, if you don't know what Kana is, get hip to it. Um, and then we got Astrogen for the absorption. So let's talk about this one. There's no melatonin, which I love. I do not like sleep aids that rely on melatonin to like get the job done. And this you could take every night, which... I'm almost addicted to this because I've been slamming this thing like the past like five nights in a row because this this is insanely good. You take you you don't feel like Ninja Zen where you just took illegal drugs. When you take Ninja Zen, at least version two, it feels like you took like Xanax or something. You're like, and you can't walk straight and you're fucked. Like that one feels illegal. Like I I think the FDA needs to crack down on that one. <laughs> that one feels like you're messed up. This one feels so clean and so smooth and like nothing illicit and you're laying in bed and like 20, 30 minutes go by and you're like, I'm not really feeling it. After the 30 minute mark, you just kind of start yawning more. You just kind of get a little tired. You get really relaxed, whatever. You're not like exhausted. Like if my mom called and said, hey, I'm in the hospital. I need you to come over here. I could get in the car and I could drive. Like Ninja Zen, you can't. You, you fall asleep at the wheel and kill six families. But this one, you feel like you could drive, but if you close your eyes and you lay in bed and you try to sleep, you will fall asleep. And the sleep on this is so nice, like refreshing. When you wake up, you're like refreshed. When you take some of these other ones, you wake up like still in a coma and you're like, what year is it? This is one of the only ones where I wake up and I'm like ready to go when I wake up. Like I, I always wake up tired, except for when I use this, I wake up so refreshed. It's awesome. Um, the dreams on here are crazy, dude. Like 
I've woke up and I was like, yo, these are some wacky dreams. And it like messes with me for half the day. They're not like nightmares, but they're vivid, vivid dreams, which is awesome. I love it. So yeah, I really have nothing bad to say about this besides the flavor. Now, GGH was like, oh, you could take this a few hours before bed just to relax and wind down. I think it would make me too tired for that. I have not tried that. I definitely want to. Um, but so far, this absolutely slaps. Dare I say it? I like this better than Ninja Zen. Dare I say it? This is my favorite sleep aid I've ever used. I'm not sponsored by NutraFit. They didn't pay me to say this. This is a good product. I love this and I'm gonna keep this in my rotation. And I'm like low key addicted. I've been using this like every night. If you guys wanna pick this up, NutraCartel.com, coupon code DTM15. It's gonna save you some big cash. Um, nothing else to say sick label with the little astronaut even though uh, space is fake but that's another video thank you guys for watching hopefully more reviews come in uh, more often I know I've been slacking but uh, yeah this one's fire pick it up all right see you guys